before starting Tomohiro's presentation in Fukuoka, I'll, I'll just share the dashboard real quick. Uh, nice to see you, nice Tomohiro. To see you. Hi. Thank, you so much. Thank you so much for Thanks joining so much. us. Uh, before we start, I'll just present uh, Fukuoka's dashboard real quick. So uh, Fukuoka is 220th worldwide, improving by uh, 20 spots, which is pretty impressive. Uh, it's 22nd in East Asia and fourth in Japan. So uh, good luck with uh, your six minute presentation, uh, Tomohira. I'll, I'll leave the stage to you. Thank you so much. So... Okay, so can I see my screen now? Yes. Thank you. Oh. Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, sorry again. Can you see my screen again? Yes, uh, we can see it's a bit small, but it's okay. I think we can oh, read. Okay. okay. Yes, we can see it bigger now. <laughs> yeah, sorry, sorry for it. Really. So, Yes, hello, I'm Nakamura from, from Fukuoka City Government, and we are very pleased to be talk about Fukuoka cities in this event. And first of all, I will introduce Japanese market briefly. And the Japan GDP is the third largest in the world, and its competitiveness ranks sixth among the world's major economies. And the Japan's economic power is not limited to Tokyo. And Japan's uh, regional economies also have GDPs as big as uh, those of the other countries. Fukuoka City is the largest city in the Kyushu region of Japan. And the Kyushu market accounts for about 10% of Japan's national economy, with its size is at the same level as that of Austria, Austria and Taiwan. So next I introduce about Fukuoka City. The Fukuoka city is located in the center of East Asia, such as China, South Korea, and Taiwan, which continued to develop and had a population of over 1.0 million, uh, making it one of the largest cities in Japan and aiming to be a leader in Asia. We have the highest population growth rate among Japanese cities, and especially we have a large number of young people. In addition, office rent and prices are low here, uh, which make Fukuoka a very suitable city for starting a new business in terms of business cost. On the top of that, the airport, seaport, and major train station are all only 10 minutes away from the city center. Uh, this kind of compactness is what makes Fukuoka special. Also, Fukuoka city is rich in nature, not only in the suburbs, but also in the city center. Also, food are attractive here. In addition, Fukuoka city has a history of 2,000 years, and we have many temples and shrines. Because of these features, media in the world has highly evaluated Fukuoka as a startup hub in Japan. So next, I introduce about our startup ecosystem and startup support. Cook City has taken various measures in three phases. In the first phase, we showed Cook City's prospect and we created its mod movement. We declared Startup City of Coca with leading entrepreneurs and investors and initiated supporting startups in 2012. In the second phase, Fukuoka Cook City was designated a national strat strategic special zone for global startups and job creation in 2014. Being designated as a national strategic special zone, it made relaxation of regulation and sy systemic reform. 
it widely become a startup environment that they could be much more uh, active. For example, we set up startup cafe to encourage increase of the number of startups. The startup cafe has been used for many people as one stop hub providing various support for startup, their business and matching partners. And we also have initiatives to attract entrepreneurs from overseas, such as the startup visa, the deduction of corporate tax and subsidiary for their residence and office. And we have signed MOU with global startup partners in 11 countries and regions for mutual startup support so that Fukuoka startups could have more chance to enter the global market. And also we joined global startup events like Swash in Finland and Latitude 59 uh, in Estonia. For the next step, we focused on startup ecosystem. We opened startup support incubation of pri public private joint sector, Fukuoka Growth Next. Uh, Fukuoka Growth Next has their own acceleration program, mentoring and events and the collaboration are the startup support institutions in Fukuoka. And we also get set up the Global Startup Center in Fukuoka Growth Next that could provide consultation for both Fukuoka startups to expand their business globally and international startups to enter the Japan market. In particular, a Global Startup Center is supporting for startup visa, localizing uh, their product for Japanese market, uh, and so on. These are the member of the Global Startup Center and they can speak English, Spanish, and Chinese. So please contact them. And we organize global business matching event collaborating with our global partners. So investors and startups have joined the event from all over the world for networking and business matching. And to the next phase, Fukuoka City has been continuously supporting uh, startups to build a support system based on Fukuoka. Fukuoka City's initiative providing intensive startup support have been evaluated by Japanese government and selected one of global startup cities in Japan, which means we can also receive national government support. This is my quick introduction about Fukuoka City's initiative for startup support. Uh, you can check our update on our website, newsletter, and Facebook. Thanks so much. Thank you so much, Tomohiro. It's been a pleasure listening to you uh, about Startup City Fukuoka. Um, yeah, amazing you. job. Thank you. Th and thank you for joining us. Yeah, thank you so much.